All right, so welcome back. And this is question 184 called Department High Salary. Now for this question, I'll give you actually two different solutions, one for Oracle and the other one for MySQL. Okay, so the Oracle solution, we're gonna use a CTE along with a um, Windows function. And then with the MySQL, we're gonna use a correlated subquery. So it's good to have an example of both just so that, you know, not an example of both, but you want to understand both examples because these are both, you know, useful tactics for these SQL questions. So for this question, the main thing is that we want the high salary, you know, on a department by department basis. And we also don't want to return to sync results. So, you know, in the IT department, Jim and Max both have the high salary of 90,000 and we want to return both of them. So do this with and I'll just call this emp mod and as our subquery here and so what we can do is with a Windows function we're gonna rank the employee table um, based on their salary so we'll do rank or select rank over and we're gonna partition it by the department ID And then we want to order it by the salary descending. And so we'll go from the highest to the lowest salary. And we're doing this on a department basis. So that's why we're partitioning by the department ID. All right. So we'll call this rank. And then we'll also want the name, the salary, and the department ID. from our employee table. Great. And so then in our actual query itself, we'll select the, and we'll look at the output here. <clears throat> and we'll be using an alias for the department. So we'll just see, call it D later on. So name as department, E.name as employee and then e dot oh and we'll just be using our because we're going to make a join to get these values as salary great And then in our from clause, we will do the department table. And this is where we get the alias D. And we're joining it with our CTE here. And then we just join it on their you know, IDs. Now, one thing to consider is that the employee table has the department ID and the ID. The ID is just the ID of the employee. And so the department ID is actually what links the two tables together. So where the int mod department ID is equal to D dot ID. And now this is a kind of special trick where we want to pull that rank. We'll set it equal to one so that we only want, you know, the highest ranking, you know, employees or rank based on their salary, you know, on a department basis. So we go ahead and run that and accept it. Great. And so for MySQL, we'll go ahead and do this one is we'll select, this will be a correlated subquery where we'll be doing that in the where clause and select and from, so the department We'll give the alias D and we also have the employee table. We'll give that the alias E. And then what we're going to select here, let's just see so D dot name as department. E dot name as employee and E dot salary as salary. 
Great, and so we want these equal to each other based on their IDs. Great, and so this is the, the trick here where we want our correlated subquery. So within our where cause, we want to be executing this on a department basis. And so the kind of, the reason why it's a correlate subquery is we'll be continuously checking the department ID. And so kind of for each department, we're going to be grabbing the maximum salary. And so any employee with that maximum salary on a department basis will kind of fulfill this where cause. So we'll select the max salary from our employee table once again, just call this E1. So just for clarification, E1 there. And then where our E1 department ID is equal to our current ID. Great. And accepted. So I, I hope that helped and good luck with the rest of your algorithms. Thanks.